To put an item on hold in the library catalog, first you need to get to the catalog, either by searching something in the box here, or by clicking on My Account up here. Well, before we try and put a hold on anything, we're going to want to log in. So we'll come down here, you log in with your library card number, no spaces, and your password or PIN, usually the last four digits of your phone number. And this is one of our admin logins. So to put something on hold, we're going to search for a title or an author. And we see a bunch of titles come up. So we'll go ahead and place a hold on this first one here. And easiest way, right down underneath the title, place a hold. Click that and scroll down and say confirm hold. Ta -da! Now you've got hold. Let's say we want another one by James Patterson. Let's say we click in here. And if you're on this page with a single item, go to the right and say place hold and confirm. Ta -da, two holds. But let's say you want to put a bunch of items on hold at once. So we are going to use our cart function right up here. So search for what you want. Got your items. You go ahead and either for each one add to cart right here underneath the title or select several with the little checkbox and up here with selected titles add to cart. If we scroll back up we can see there's items in our cart. We're going to click there, and you've got all these items. Now to place all these on hold at once, you say select all, then place hold. And that's going to give us the confirm screen again. So we'll go ahead and scroll down and say confirm hold. And that will confirm all the holds that we had in that cart. And now if you realize you accidentally put something on hold that you didn't want, you can come right over here and say cancel. Now if you scroll back up to your cart, you'll notice that it still has five items in there. Um, your items have been placed on hold, so this is just keeping them handy if you want to refer to them later. It doesn't do anything bad if you leave them in there, but if you want to be tidy, you can go ahead and say empty and close. And okay. And now the cart is empty, and we have our items on hold. From here, just wait for the library to send you an email um, saying your holds have been pulled and then you can schedule your pickup date.